Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, today I have a mascara challenge for you. It's the Marc Jacobs Velvet Noir Major Volume Mascara versus my favorite mascara, which is the Chanel Le Volume de Chanel. I recently was watching Alicia. She has her own beauty channel on YouTube. Uh, it called Hello Alicia, and um, she done the mascara challenge. Uh, Marc Jacobs versus her own favorite mascara, which I believe was one from Ellie's Fuzz. And uh, I really liked her video, so I asked her and I thought, um, yeah, I will do uh, the challenge with my own favorite mascara. I will link um, Alicia's video below so um, you can check it out. She's a great lady. I really like her channel and I really liked her video that she made. So let's start Jacob's mascara and I have mine in Noir. It looks like that, very sleek, very beautiful and the brush looks like that. And I will challenge that to my Chanel Le Volume de Chanel. Very elegant packaging, of course, what you expect from Chanel. And the brush looks like that. It's like very thick brush. And what that mascara promised to give you like, you know, that beautiful volume separation and everything. Basically guys, what I would like from my mascara is, I would like a mascara to give me volume, to give me length, to give me separation, not clump the lashes, uh, to be extra intense, extra black and perform well in the top lashes and the bottom lashes and also to keep the curl on my lashes too. So I know, I ask everything, but that's what I want for my mascara. One of my favorite mascaras is the Chanel Le Volume de Chanel. That's why I will challenge the Marc Jacobs today versus the Chanel and see which one it's gonna win. This is the Marc Jacobs and this is the Chanel. You see difference here. The Chanel is bigger and rounder and the Marc Jacobs is more like hourglass shape. I will put in one eye the Chanel Le Volume de Chanel and I will put it in this eye here. And as you see, you see the difference here with one coat. Uh, now I will add a second coat. And now I'm going to put on my lower lashes too. It's one of my favorite mascaras, performs beautifully. And now I'm going to try the Marc Jacobs one. So let's see what Marc Jacobs can do. That is with one coat of mascara. And now I'm gonna add a second coat. Holy, wow. And that is with a second coat. And now on the bottom lashes. In this eye, I've got the Marc Jacobs mascara, and in this eye, I've got the Chanel mascara.
I am very, very impressed with the Marc Jacobs mascara. Very, very impressed. I wasn't expecting that. I was never ever thought that I would find an equivalent mascara or maybe a little bit better. Marc Jacobs mascara, I have to say, equivalent to Chanel, if not a little bit better. Especially on their low lashes, the perform is beautiful. It feels very lightweight, it has an intense color, it gives me volume, gives me separation, and the lower lashes performs really well on the lower lashes, if not better than the Chanel on the lower lashes. So, wow, <laughs> that's, that's a big word. Leave me a comment below and let me know what do you think. Which one do you think it performed better, the Marc Jacobs mascara or the Chanel? would like to really know what you see. So far as I see, I really like it. I think it's equivalent, if not a bit better. So I'm very, very impressed. I will keep using it and keep you posted. I really enjoyed doing this video challenge. Um, thanks a lot to Alisa from Hello Alisa. I hope you enjoyed it too. And uh, let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! Mwah.